<laughs> I'm dressed as Supergirl. <laughs> I love it. This is the sixth Kids Con New England. It's coming up. What can kids and families expect? Yeah, we have all sorts of amazing creators from across the country, uh, comic and children's book creators, artists. Um, they'll be presenting workshops and you can learn how how to draw Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with artist Jim Lawson, uh, as well as a bunch of others that learn how to create comics and also all about the arts. Our events promote art education and literacy. So you'll get to meet creators firsthand. You'll get to learn how to create comics yourself, as well as hope to get everyone excited about reading because <laughs> comics and graphic novels are a great way to get kids excited about reading. There will be a costume contest and plenty of superheroes to meet, along with pirates, princesses, Pikachu, and Yoshi. Jedi training will help young ones who are strong with the Force, and there's even a magic show. What kind of ages is Kids Con for? Generally, I'd say ages 4 through 12, um, but we do have things for everyone, even the parents. <laughs> and um, we do have a variety of creators that have books for older for teens as well um, as adults, and um, but everything is family friendly, so nothing explicit. So you can rest assured that everything that you'll see will be family appropriate. Why are comics such a good thing for families to get involved in, not just kids, but as a whole family? It's an, an activity that everyone can enjoy. Um, I know that a lot of you have the, the geek fandom of adults. They love superheroes and comics um, that they grew up on as well as me. So it's fun to pass that on to the next generation and that you guys can actually, um, the families can create stories together. We have writing workshops too. So they can create adventures together and then illustrate it as well as we want people to take it home as well and to continue to create, especially with the winter months <laughs> upon us coming up. So, and um, the school breaks and vacations, great time to create stories. Emily not only loves to dress up as her favorite comics, she creates them as well. I'm um, a comic book artist and children's book illustrator too. And I've been creating stories and illustrating them since I was a little kid. So it really goes back to um, my love of reading books. At KidsCon, Emily will be premiering the comic book she illustrates called Aria's Adventures. It's about this girl, Aria. Um, she has a vivid imagination and it often gets her into trouble. <laughs> but it's basically about her fun adventures she shares with her family, um, particularly her dad, who's a bit of a klutz. And um, so she just interacts and her imagination gets carried away. Like she thinks he's an an evil troll and she has to protect her mom, the princess. And so she has all sorts of fun adventures. What's your favorite thing? You've been doing this for several years about sharing your love of comics and writing and illustrating with, with kids. Yeah. I always love to see when kids, um, eyes light up with, uh, not only my art and stories, um, but also seeing them enjoying it, um, make, brings me back to when I was a kid. And I so wish that there were things like this when I was younger. <laughs> um, being a child of the eighties, we didn't really have as much access to these conventions and everything in the comic book world was kind of more underground. And so now in, it's everywhere and you can go and really appreciate it. <laughs> Now, Kids Con New England is this Saturday. Tickets are $12. Kids under five are free. We will have a link to the event on the 207 section of our New Center Main website and app. I love that, like a safe space to, to just be yourself Dress up. and do yeah. your thing. <laughs>